Before enrolling to this program, I knew that I wanted to go to med school, but I, I just didn't have the preparation in order to become a strong candidate. It really helped me decide what I wanted to do if I wanted to do medical school or optometry school. I thought the training here would definitely show people that I was ready for medical school and I could handle the course. We're rather proud of our master's program in medical physiology. We've designed it for students with a bachelor's degree who are interested in additional training in the physiological sciences. Unlike some of the other programs that are kind of bridge programs into medical school, this is a legitimate master's in physiology program, and if you change your mind, this program can prepare you for going into the physiology field and the research field. We're also encouraged to explore other avenues, the master's in public health programs, the nutrition programs, anywhere you might also have interests. I was actually uh, pre-med, and in the program I had a lot of opportunities to get out uh, of uh, classroom time and explore my, my own desires. I actually switched to dentistry. You can complete our program in one to two years. Our core curriculum is a series of related courses in the first year. I like the, the focus aspect of this program, focused specifically on medical physiology, so I feel like I'm really learning the important aspects of the body. You get a taste of the real nitty-gritty science behind physiology, and then you see it actually applied in clinical cases. I really like that it was a block system based on the organs, so we, always, we started with um, cell physiology, we went to neuro, cardio, and so on and so forth, and it really made it easier to learn the physiology and then learn the pathophys. Our teachers are case faculty who are experts in the areas that they teach, occasional outside experts, and world-renowned authorities that we bring into the university for weekly seminars. One of the classes here, Translational Physiology, kind of plugs you in to meet all these physicians that lecture here and you can go up and talk to them and a lot of them are willing to let you shadow them. I've had the opportunities of shadowing in the Breast Cancer Center and doing research in breast cancer. It allowed me to see that medical education extends beyond the textbook. Our overall philosophy is that we want you to be successful. This program really is dedicated to getting you to the next step. Whether you want to go to dental school, go get your PhD, go to medical school, go to PA school, day one they tell you that they're not interested in keeping you here, they want to move you on to the next step. We help you in the application process for professional school, tutor you in writing your personal statement, and coach you for interviews. Our program has a very strong advisory system. Each student is assigned a faculty academic advisor, a faculty career advisor, and two second year MS student peer advisors. What I liked most about this program was how approachable the advisors were. Like Dr. Nesek is very friendly, very humble. He reaches out to other people to make opportunities available for you. So my first year we also we had TAs and they were very instrumental in helping us understand some of the difficult concepts in, in the physiology uh, text. If they have questions about course selection or um, how they should target better target their study skills, I'll help them target their test taking skills depending on how they looked at a previous exam. I help students prepare for an exam that ranks them both among their peers in the program and among students nationally. All of us have improved our GPAs, our MCAT scores have gone up, and that's due to the support of this program. They are always there if you want uh, anything in the academically or even if you need anything in your personal life. Students have 12 hours of elective courses that they can take anywhere in the university. I've taken classes all over the anatomy department. I'm taking a chem class next semester. I went to Peru this past summer. I volunteered for two weeks. I taught Peruvians physical health, um, physical training. Many students become involved in research. I've been working with brain tissue samples and the effects of diet uh, for stroke and ischemic models and whether or not they're conferred neuroprotective properties. I work specifically with magnesium. Right now I'm looking at its interaction with the immune system. I'm studying different cells that I grow and I inject different levels of magnesium and then I compare them to a control. Going on rounds at University Hospital with um, uh, physicians and understanding the conditions that their patients are in without them having to go into in-depth detail was kind of a, a testimony to myself in terms of how far I've come. From having an OK GPA in undergrad to having a 4.0 in graduate school speaks 
leaps and bounds about who you are as a student. Now that I'm finishing the program, I've been accepted to dental school. Both of my interviews, when I got them, they raved about the program. They were like, it's great to see the master's program on there. It's a rigorous program. Since graduating from this program, I've applied to 19 and I've gotten five interviews and two acceptances so far. I've currently been accepted to three schools already. The program got me into two schools. <laughs> That's life-changing.